millions of guys are born good looking. But not many are really good looking. Even fewer are really, 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 really good looking. <laughs> Meet Dr. Pepper's really, 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 really good looking guy. This underwear model turned Dr. Pepper spokesman is TV's newest sensation. That's right, the hunky guys and ads phenomenon seems to just be plain unstoppable. So why fight? Tonight it's showbiz hotness. Yes, showbiz tonight is jumping right on the hot hunk commercial train. We know that most people aren't really looking at what the new diet Dr. Pepper guy is drinking. And yeah, this guy you're looking at, Josh Button, was a model until this ad made him practically overnight famous. But who really cares, right? The huge viral reaction to Josh isn't exactly about acting or even a can of soda. Come on, you know, you're looking at Josh's abs. Don't worry, we're not going to judge. Neither will Josh Button, who is right here with us from Hollywood tonight. Good to see you, Josh. Hi, AJ. Thanks for having me. Hey, great to have you here. Love the Zoolander vibe in the ad. We know that flesh sells, but come on. You have got to be surprised at just how wildly popular this ad has become, right? It has definitely exceeded expectations. It's been uh, quite a trip. And, and part of it for me is it is a funny ad, but it's also based in reality. I got to tell you, I actually knew a guy who, who thought of himself that way. He said, I think one time he's in the top 10 percent. Well, I won't ask what his name is. Yeah, you might know him out there, actually. Uh, now that you're pretty much a household face, and name, Josh. I, I gotta imagine you get recognized on the street by now. Can you give me a sense of, I don't know, maybe one of the wildest reactions you're getting or hearing when people do recognize you and say, hey, Dr. Pepper ad guy? You'd be surprised, actually. Uh, luckily, it hasn't gone into my personal life or onto the street yet. I uh, actually had a little bit of issues um, in New York with one or two people who mistaken me for somebody else, but from this ad, no. <laughs> well, can you tell me who that was? Uh, I think they just thought I was an actor. Uh, it had to be somebody a little bit more famous than uh, I am, for sure. Okay, they well, saw the production, and they said, I'm going to go up to this guy and get a picture, get an autograph, and they didn't know whose autograph they were getting. But, but I imagine sure. if, if it hasn't happened, people are going to ask you to just you know, take your shirt off. Because, quite frankly, I'm looking at my uh, iPhone right here. I have a dozen emails from Showbiz Tonight staffers asking you if you would do the interview without your shirt on. Without I, my I, shirt? Yeah, I, I'm not going to force you to do that. They, they're just asking me to do that. Uh, all right, so here's the thing. Before this ad came along, you know, we had that zesty craft salad dressing guy, real nice guy, Anderson Davis. He has used, used his success and, and has uh, a plan in place now to capitalize on it. What about you, man? Uh, I'm looking forward to what comes next. It's, uh, there's definitely opportunities out there, and we'll see what happens. All right. Charles, would you put up the split? Josh and I are going to do a stare-off uh, as we take this out. Uh, uh, me and Josh, right there. Can we see the two-shot? All right. We're going to okay. go Zoolander. All right, Josh. Great having you here. Thank you so much.